Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. Um, so this time, I think I'm just going to be kind of clearing out the map here. I don't know if it's going to take the full episode, but until then, or I mean, after that, if it doesn't take the full episode, then we'll come up here and, and start heading north. Walking but death. for now, oh yeah, it's over here. I have to jump from rock to rock, all nimbly bimbly. But I'm actually going to cut here and see if something happens. <laughs> Ribbit to ribbit. Hello, Froggy. Do I have a speak with animals? Anything? Keep a blade close. Can't afford to stay idle. No rest for the wicked, I see. Does not look like it. Still breathing, despite everything. Oh, I ran into a hilarious amount of traps. <laughs> Kind of fucking stupid. All my guys are about to die again. Let me actually short rest. The edge off. And let me. Don't I have an animal speaking potion? Maybe. Is that it? Yeah. Hello, Froggy. Oh, did you not like Aunt Auntie Ethel? Glad Happy, I could help. Happy, come present. Yeah. Swift as my feet can carry me. I guess we were supposed to go this way before hitting Auntie Ethel. Where the fuck is this frog taking me? Okay. Here! Shiny! Bye! Oh, pouch. And some shit garbage. Thanks, frog. Oh, I'm in. Hello, sir. Ah, stranger. Forgive the aroma. You catch a waft of something foul, metallic, and sickly sweet. I'm surprised I did not find this How man. He is standing one. right next to Auntie Ethel's Most house. Most monsters will think twice before making a meal of me. You're a monster hunter. I'm surprised. I thought all girl were vagrant cutthroats. <laughs> Uh, I knew you were jackass, but racist? I'm shocked. <laughs> oh, say Admiral, nothing. We steal chickens, curse your crops, seduce your daughters, the list goes on. I wish I had half the power settled folk think my people possess. Alas, I am a simple wanderer. A simple wanderer and monster hunter. But I'm no witch doctor or cutthroat. Okay. If I were a cutthroat, I wouldn't admit it either. Uh, so what monster are you hunting? I assume you want to kill the hag? We already oh, did. Make a deal with her? <laughs> Probably think you can outfox the old deer. Right, but very wrong. My prey is a vampire spawn, much less impressive than the beast that uh -oh. lives here. His name is Astarian. Uh... But I fear he's gone to ground. I hope the hag of these lands can help me flush him out, if I can afford her blood price. Well. Um. Shit. <laughs> well, here he is. What would you have? What would you Not do if you kill? My orders Find are him. to capture him. Oh. Uh, and bring him where exactly? Baldur's Gate. My people wait for me there. Only a spawn. I don't know. I'm sure a vampire spawn could still rip out your throat if he felt like it. He is right, unfortunately. They are only weak when compared to their masters. During the day, we have the advantage. 
But at night, when they hunt, you'll not find a more deadly quarry. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, I'm sure he can creep right up on you. Interesting, Astarian. What do you think? <laughs> Thanks for the warning. We'll be careful. May your road be kind. Wait, that's it. We're just walking away. Don't you think we should do something about the vampire issue? <laughs> Fine, this is him, kill him. Uh, do whatever you Excellent. want. Excellent. A starion? No, it can't be. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh shit. I think he's targeting a star. <laughs> Oops. Uh, let's. I can't sneak attack him. I have 20% there. Uh, can I cast Guidance on myself? That works. I'll take that. And then Shadowheart, can you heal our boy, take please? You. Damn, I rolled really low on that. Uh, let me also put this on you. Because I know he's just going to fucking target the shit out of you. You, however... 60%. Hey, there we go. Got it. And then I guess I hex your... Oh, that's a strength save. I already did that. It's charisma. Wisdom for command, maybe? Ready. Or dex for radiant flame or sacred flame. I'm really... Uh, not too keen on... Hex right now. It's basically just well, so much give me extra damage. I think I will hex your wisdom. Death is but a word away. Okay, and then you. I guess you can ice knife. I don't know what I'm hitting there. Okay. Fucking bullshit. And he's misty stepping away. Or he just misty stepped into himself. Okay. Starion's dead again. Excellent. Shuttleheart, you're just gonna be a fucking healing the shit out of him, eh? I can't do shit with you, bud. Um, drink another potion, I guess. And I guess if I can get in closer, because he can't hit me with. Everything. If I threaten him, like if I get in close. You shouldn't have made me your enemy. bro yeah that fucking hurts do I just ice knife him again level 2 ice knife or level 1 level 1 it does so much damage dude you are fucking kidding me right now what is his AC 15 my god brother brother holy shit my guy Dude. Can I finally fucking attack you? I can. Path is interrupted. God, 14. Why can't he do this better? 
Okay. What does the happy do again? Temporary stated plus one to all attack rolls, saving throws, and ability checks. That's pretty fun good. Let's get in there with Shadowheart. I guess continue to heal Starion. Oh, and he gets the Blade Ward too. That's really good. Uh, and that was a bonus action, so I can still hit this man. 30% ain't that good. Charm person? No. It's not gonna work. <laughs> I'll just try for this. He saved. Awesome. Cool. The dance of death. I can't really get an angle on him. Is he hiding behind something? Oh my god, he is. He's hiding behind all these fucking tree limbs. Another day, another fight. Okay, save the strength, save our constitution. I didn't want him going in there anyway. Uh, I will put this back on him. Buff his AC a bit. Uh, let's fly. I saw, can't find path. Okay. So Starion's like blocking him in. So I can't really fucking do anything. Starion has movement left or no? A little bit, but not enough. Uh, magic missile is ass. Yeah. Torment. Speaking truthfully, I'm a little surprised you chose to shield a Starion. Ah! Shut up. <laughs> He's my bro, my buddy guy pal. Uh, ooh. Has advantage against monstrosity type enemies. Now, does that do more than my crossbow? Should, right? 3 to 12. Fuck, I'll take it. Okay. That scared me, actually. Um. Well, fuck me. Take another short rest. Light on my feet. Okay. Trap disarm toolkit, garlic, of course. What is this? Temporary hit points. Flesh rotting. That's gross. And some stuff here. Uh, interesting. I guess he was hired by the people that wanted him. Uh, whatever that family was called, I forgot the name of already. Okay, but let's continue. Well, I guess now we're going into the goblin camp in the surrounding area. So I think we're all done with the bog here. The boggy swamp. Maybe can get over here? I have no idea. Doesn't look like it from all the surrounding stuff, but I'll find that out later. Blood. I need to hold on. You are fucking kidding me, dude. Keep your distance, darling. Step lightly. Uh, no time to rest. I had another visit from that dream figure. Oops. I didn't mean to click you on did too. It claims that if we infiltrate the heart of the cult that's giving out these parasites, we'll find the answers we're looking for. It gave me another gift, too. Just like it did the first time it appeared. Rather generous, if you ask me. Wait, what did you get? Seems straightforward to me. If we want to inter infiltrate Moonrise Towers, these tadpole gifts might be our best way to do it. 
Uh, whatever is at the heart of the cult will find it by any means possible. I don't like it. This whole thing feels like a trap. Uh, we'll do it by any and means possible. It, we can see how many more of these little worms we can harvest. Now, was there anything else? Uh, so there's a monster hunter after you now. Not anymore. Which is all that matters, really. But why was he hunting you? What did you do? I didn't do anything. I was kidnapped. Just like you. It seems Cazador wants me back. Cazador, that's who I was thinking of. Got enough running the mind flares. <laughs> You're past chasing us too. Uh, who's Cazador exactly? Cazador Tsar is a vampire lord in Baldur's Gate. The patriarch of his coven and a monster obsessed with power. He turned me nearly 200 years ago. Damn. I became his spawn. And he became my tormentor. Uh, you're sure he's behind this? It was him, I'm sure. Only he would know to send the Gur after me. It was a group of Gur that attacked me that night in Baldur's Gate. I would have died had Kazador not appeared and saved me. Mmm, so it was kind of a fuck you. Saved you by turning into a vampire slave. You can't hold every Gur responsible for what happened I to you. I think you'll find I can. And there's nothing your bleeding heart can do to change my mind. Well, our boy's racist. <laughs> what a motley crew we have. Uh... Well, he didn't mention the slave clause at the time. And now he sends a Gur monster hunter for me. It's a message. He's reminding me of his power. Even in the middle of nowhere, he can reach me. And he wants me back. But why capture you? Why not just kill you? Maybe he wants to make an example of me. To show what happens to runaways. Or maybe he thinks death is too good for me. Uh... Well, you're safe <laughs> with me, pal. Safe? You think I'm safe? Do you know the power? A vampire lord possesses. What is he like? He Level shape. Ten Turn to mist. Two <laughs> walls to do his bidding. Shrug off blows like they're nothing. He could walk into our camp tonight and kill you with his bare hands. And you'd be lucky if death was the worst thing that happened to you. What do you suggest? First, we have to. Uh, uh, <laughs> I don't know. Well, if we kill his lackeys, he'll just send more. We just have to be vigilant, keep our wits about us, and kill any monster hunters on sight. Okay. Uh, what do you think of that I thing that happened way back then? It's tempting. If I keep the tadpole, I risk transforming into a grotesque monster. If I lose the tadpole, Cazador has control of me, body and soul. And I return to the shadows. It's grim either way. So why not sell what's left of my soul to a devil? Better he has it than Cazador. Yeah, he's kind of in a pickle, huh? <laughs> uh, we have other options, better options. Figuring out what's happening to us, confronting a god called the Absolute, and then finding time to kill my old master before he can control me once more. Yes, that's an option, but I wouldn't bet eternity on it. Um, that's what I was thinking, honestly. Okay. Well, I'm about to die, as you can see. I'm gonna take a long rest. And see if anything happens. Never mind, he wants to talk to me again. Uh, damn. Looking at something. Uh. How'd you know I was the here? The only benefit to a mirror when you have my condition. It doesn't quite make up for the lack of a reflection, mind you. Do you miss seeing your face? Preening in the looking glass. Petty vanity. Of course I miss it. I've never even seen this face. Not since it grew 
fangs and my eyes turned red. Um. <laughs> what color were I, they before? I don't know. I can't remember. My Rip. face is just some dark shape in my past. Another thing I've lost. This episode's all about a starian. Uh. <laughs> I like what I see. It's best not aging exactly gracefully. Yeah, these other two are romance options. Aging? What do you mean, aging? I'm a vampire. Forever young. <laughs> I'm kidding, you look great. Really? Anything in particular? Nope. Uh, what the hell? I'm just flirting with them. I have no choice but to flirt with them. So I'm going Very all in. Good. Now just tell me I'm beautiful and we can call it a day. Uh, you're pretty good. Not Gale good. <laughs> uh, that all you want? Shallow praise? Shadowheart's pretty good too. How dare you? <laughs> I thought we had something special. Still, you're nice too. I better get some beauty sleep. It seems I need it if I'm to catch up with the competition. I wanted a Liza option there. Just like, but her frog face is so better. No one else needs to talk to me. Cool. Going to bed. Forty-one's fine. Uh oh. It seems to be the perfect night. To oh, spend that's time right. Together. Just you and I. Assuming you haven't changed your mind, of course. No, I actually just turned down a star and. <laughs> you made it. Come here. Sit with me. Cheers. What do you have in your mind besides the bottle that is? Oh, and Dream of Missing It. Did you think I wouldn't show? Drain the cup in one swallow. <laughs> wouldn't dream of missing it. So eager. I'm surprised it took you this long. I mean, I had other shit going on. Well, to begin, I think a toast is in order. Any suggestions? To the worms in our head. To survival. Very practical. We could have toasted to that every night so far. Here's to many more. Survival. Nom, 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 now nom, tell nom. me something about yourself. And no tadpoles, dragons, marauding goblins, or anything like that. Something about you. Ooh. You first. Disadvantage from rotting flesh. Thank you for the wine and leave. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me about yourself. Yeet. <laughs> um, share a little memory from growing up in Baldur's Gate. Sure. Seems like you truly know the city. I never got to experience never seen my it. liking. <laughs> Don't stop now. Not just as things are getting interesting. Hmm. Your turn. Add bonus. Advantage. So it's just a straight 10. No! Oh, I'm rerolling. And I can't use the scroll again. Oh my god. Bullshit. Don't laugh, but I'm not quite sure I have anything to share. When you worship Shard, secrecy is everything. We'll sacrifice our own memories when ordered to. A lot of the little things... They're lost to me right now. Damn, everybody's got fucking memory problems in this group. Astaria's been too fucking... alive for too long... to have any memories of what happened. 
I don't remember a fucking single thing that happened before the ship. She gave up her memories. Gale is just... I don't even know what the fuck Gale is. <laughs> uh, do you think your memories will ever come back? Oh, no. You told me that once. I did. And you remembered. You're sweet. There's still plenty of wine. And the whole night is ahead of us. Funny that you can't swim, yet you choose to sit precariously on a rock edge. Uh-oh. Nearly night. <laughs> the others will be awake soon. Damn, look at that Jesus hole in her hand. Others can wait, I don't want this to end yet. Another moment won't kill them, I suppose. Well, it might, but let's take that risk. Thank you for last night. <laughs> My pleasure. It was just what I needed. She trails off. You read an invitation in her eyes. Ooh. I'm a romance everyone. Uh. <laughs> Fuck it. Shadowheart approves. My big ass fucking hand. <laughs> Just slowly coming across the camera. What a big lumbering idiot. I love him. Might have to cut this for YouTube. Oh no. <laughs> the other one's hurt, fine. Did it? What? Pain was worth it? I should think so. Why the Let's fuck would it hurt? Back, if we must. Whatever, I'll humor her. She's all about pain, right? <sighs> and she wants to talk again. All's well, I hope. Of course, unless something's a matter. No. I just wanted to see how you felt after the night we spent together. When we talked. And kissed. Oh. Uh, perhaps we got carried away. <laughs> it was a mistake. Oh, I wish you would forget it happened. Um, meant a lot to I me. I hope so too. Though I'm not sure what kind of courtship will be afforded, given all that we're facing. But if you want to see where this goes. I do as well. You wanna just be fucking fighting friends? We fuck and we fight and we fight and we fuck. <laughs> uh Sharon is something special, I wanna talk about it. Oh, these are all okay, tell me about Mother I'm Superior. Not sure what else I can say, at least until I can remember more. She taught me, trained me, punished me. As a mother Often, should. <laughs> I think I feel her influence when the wound pains me. Not even memories, just glimpses, impressions. Perhaps the wound is her <gasps> Scratch what's the talk. Shah bid her to do. <laughs> I don't know. Alright, wrap it up, bitch. Scratch wants to talk. <laughs> uh, we share, spare, we share something special. Fuck. Very serious of you. But go ahead. Admit it. You've never had a relationship quite like this one, have you? Admit it, bitch. How are you faring? It's strange. I've been dwelling on what I told you before about wanting to become a dark justicia. But perhaps I should be content with my lot. I'm already blessed to have you at my side, after all. Talk about what happened Fine. to us. What's on your mind? I do not know. Nothing. Leave. Dog. Come here. Dog, come Dog here. Dog wags his tail, a small bag clenched between his teeth. Oh, he's got something for me. Gimme, gimme. Thank you, Squeech. 
Thank you, Squidge. He gives in and surrenders his bone. To you. <laughs> he gave me a bone. And now I have one to give to Shadow Heart. <laughs> Scratch's tongue lolls out happily, his tail wagging even <sighs> faster. Fun times ahead. Okay. Well, item received. Bone. If I throw the bone. He cares not for the bone. Actually, he just saw me. He just gave me a bone and then I threw it in, threw it away in front of his face. I don't want to do that. I'll sell it later. Uh, how the fuck do I get rid of this fucking rotting flesh? Do I have a potion of cured disease or some shit? Uh... Antidote? That's not a poison, though. Neutralizes all effects of poison. Mm. I do not know. I will go through all of these. Give me one second. Oh, you know what? Shadowheart may be able to help. Here's from disease. Get over here. No time for Danny. Sucks that I just now thought about this. I'm gonna waste a level two spell right off the bat, but. And it's gone. Thank Shadow Art. I was gonna say Christ, but. Oh, God. Now she's getting clingy. I'm getting a little. There's something I've been wanting to share with you. If now's a good time. We literally just got back. Uh, what is it? It's difficult to put into words. I think it might be easier to just show you. Use the tadpole, the connection. Come into my mind. Are you sure? I'm sure. I trust you. What am I going to see? How I came to be who I am. How I found my way to Lady Shah's embrace. Okay. I got no choice. <laughs> I don't remember how it started. Oh my god. My shoulder's too ended. big. I can't fucking see anything. <laughs> I can't tell if it cut to black or my shoulder's still in the way. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, yeah, she is a feral wolves, doesn't she? Is that a mask? Yes. <laughs> she asked my name. I can't remember what I said. I can't remember anything before those words. All I know is she saved my life and gave me a new home with Lady Shah. <laughs> it hurts. And it's done. <laughs> That's all I remember. Something sparks in your memory about Salunite rites of passage. You heard once about how they would send their children out into the wilds to navigate their way home. Uh, you look like you were wearing a moonstone. That commonly worn by Salunites? You're reading too much into things. A childhood bauble, that's all. Just because Salunites claim something doesn't mean they own it. Okay. 
being very defensive. <laughs> Thank you for sharing me. I know it hadn't been easy. Normally I'd agree. But with you, it's getting easier by the moment. Oh, she's so smitten. Uh, you and I share some special, I think. I want to talk about it. Okay, no. Those are all regular options. Okay, back to whatever the fuck I was doing. Fuck me. Dude, of course. Of course I take a fucking nap. Now everything explodes around me. Holy hell. And then we're back in the goblin camp area. Did I ever explore this way? Oh, my camera's all fucky-wucky. Hmm. Mountain pass. It's survival. Is it over here? That's cute. Hey, got it. Hell yeah. That was shit. Mountain pass. Make sure you type up any loose ends before advancing. Worry that any area you're about to enter will be bitterly difficult for your party at your level. Okay, cool. Have a good day. Okay, well that filled up the entire episode. I didn't really find much. There was a little patch here that I didn't get, but nothing was there. Um, uh, thought the frog was the only thing in the, the vampire hunter fight. Not much, honestly. I cannot, for the life of me, find a way over here to clear this out. So I have no idea if it's possible. Let me know if I'm wrong. I am stupid. But next time, we will definitely be heading over the bridge into where I saw all the blood. There's tunes of blood. Oops. Yeah. Tons and tons of viscera and gore. So it'll be a fun time for sure. I'll see you in the next one.